What's going on guys? It's your boy Devin so take you back to a brand new video. Today's video, I got another video for you guys today. Today's video um is basically on how to make a Fortnite profile picture. And this is a kind of like a part two to my how to make a clean Fortnite banner. And basically it's just because I didn't make a I haven't made a video on how to make a Fortnite profile picture. So I want to make a video on that. And I don't want to make my channel only on Fortnite, just because most of my community on uh, here on my channel are basically just Fortnite community creators so i want to inspire and make videos on fortnite so if there's any other video games from out there that you guys want me to make into photoshop just ask in the comments down below and i'll make a video on it so what we're gonna be working with is we're gonna be working with this kind of profile kind of profile picture you can use any kind of type of background but i'll be just showing you guys how you guys can make an easy one and how you guys can get use any skin in the Fortnite community, any any skin that you see in the guys in the game, you can get it here, and it's pretty easy to make. So, um, if you guys just want a basic profile picture, just like this, with no words, just the profile skin and the skin that you guys like to use, you can just use this and make something simple like this. So yeah, so let's get started. And then the width and height, it's gonna be 800 by 800, so that's kind of like the pixels. Or you guys can do 500 by 500, but 800 by 100, it's the exact one. And they're gonna use resolution 72. Press OK. All right, so now we're gonna go ahead and pick over a skin. So I used this Cuddle Team Leader skin in the first example, but we're gonna use a different one in, in a different example, so I can show you guys. So I'm thinking of uh, going with this Raven skin right here, just because it looks cool. Um, this one I I suggest not to use because it's pretty it's pretty small and you won't be able to see it inside the profile picture. Uh, I suggest if you can use this icon or this one right here, the future one. Um, I'm gonna go with this future one just because it looks cooler and it, it shows kind of more, more emotion. So I right click on it and press copy image. I go into I go into Photoshop and press Control V to paste it in, and then press Control T to resize this, and so we can get like make it so we can see it inside here and then once inside inside the box we're gonna go over to this magic wand tool click on it make sure you're on this option and then click on the black part of the image and then press ctrl x and it'll cut out everything that was black in the back in the beginning so we're gonna go ahead and move this and then we're gonna resize this to like how we want it so i'm gonna make it kind of big just because like it needs to like stay in the image and be able to see it from like a very small perspective um once we have that you can check if, it, if you want it in the middle if if it's not in the middle or not you can use control r to browse the ruler tool and then click on this um move tool or v on your keyboard and then drag out like some line and if the lines like doesn't move in the middle that means it, that's where the middle is and then press control t again you can find the middle from there and then if to get rid of this line you just press ctrl h and it should be get rid of now we're going to go ahead and add a background so the background i'm going to be using is a season four a season nine fortnite image um the last one i used in my last um tutorial was this one and i decided to go with this one and i should change it up and go with the block so i'm gonna copy image go to go back to for photoshop and press ctrl v and then it should be here so we drag down this layer to layer one and then resizes into like our liking so let's put it right here now we're gonna make this profile picture black and white so i make a new layer drag the new layer on the bottom change the color to black press alt backspace to fill in the color click back on layer two of the image in the background change it to luminosity and then change the opacity down to like 75 um hold shift and click both the layers on the bottom and press ctrl e to merge them both and then and then if you don't have an overlay like images like this if you guys want overlay images that you guys want to use you can use you can download my um 1000 subscribers back graphics pack it'll be in the link down in the description below uh, it's free you just have to download it and um if you guys don't like none of these colors you can change the colors later on when you guys get to photoshop but yeah so so we just go and pick one a, a random one like just go ahead and find like a, a cool one that will look better and i feel like i'm gonna go with this black one here so i'm press click on the layer press ctrl a ctrl c go back into our, our template press ctrl v and then ctrl t and then we're gonna go on top of it 
So um, to change color of a black and white image is pretty easy. You just have to put a, a color fill on top of it. So we make a new layer and then we change the color onto what we want. So we're gonna be working with purple. Um, to get the exact purple, you can use a color pick tool, tool and then click somewhere that's purple. Or you just can guess like, oh yeah, that's purple right there, obviously. So we just alt backspace again and then use the normal mode, use the filter mode and then like choose like something that matches in the background so like that darken looks better so it looks like it's matching with the background already and then hold shift again click both of these layers and then control e to merge them both now since we merge them both we can go ahead and use the um, filter tool and then change change different um things that we want here uh i like to go to i'll probably use a pin light and then maybe like change the opacity on it so since we have that um i had i made this the purple background or overlay into pin light it looks pretty nice here um you can use any image and then you can get it to a different color um if you guys want it to look like this kind of thing right here you would have to use hard light or um hard mix hard mix is one of them that you can use it to make it look like if it's splatter in the background but right now we're going to be using it where we can see the background in the back and then we can use a brush and to make it stand out a little bit more. So we click on layer five and make a new layer on top of it to make a layer six. And then we resize this brush about like 800 uh, pixels. And then use the same color we used in the background of the purple. And then just click right in the middle. I don't feel like this purple is any that good. So I'm gonna go ahead and use the purple up a little bit. I'm gonna make it seem pink. somewhere in the middle there you go and then we can just change the um, filter of it too Lean, linear dodge looks pretty nice linear dodge add looks pretty nice so we're gonna use that right there and then we can add another brush spotlight tool on top of it so we drag a new layer on top of the of our skin and then you make the color brush white and then you can put a little spotlight on top of it and then change the opacity on it to like about 75 and that should look nice that actually looks nice um you guys can add more overlays to it still pretend if i wanted a a better overlay like maybe um we'll go with this overlay and just press ctrl a ctrl c and then go back into our in here and then add this on top and if you were to make it black and white again, so I'm gonna go ahead and make this black and white. If you drag the mix of it, you drag it to the bottom and you guys can get different effects. Like this one looks pretty nice. I would just have to drag up the brush tool so you can see it on top. And there you go. This is how you guys can make a simple, easy Fortnite profile picture. You can use this profile picture into anything. If you have an Xbox, you can upload to Xbox app. If you guys have a YouTube channel, you just guys just you don't want no text. You just want the profile the picture of the skin. You can use it here. Um, where where I got the skins in this where I, the skins I got here. The skins I got here. Okay, that makes fucking sense. Where I got the skins at was a Fortnite website. It was called fbnr.o slash office slash raven. But um, if you guys want the link to the website and you guys can get all these skins and PNGs images from Fortnite from for free and to upload it to Photoshop, I'll link the link down in the description down below. If you guys want to see the my 1,000 subscribers back graphics pack and get these overlays, uh, you, there's gonna link down in the description down below. And yeah, so thank you for um coming to my channel if you guys need any help leave a comment down below um make sure to leave a like if you guys like the video and this has been your boy devin to techie and i'm out peace out guys <laughs>